Temple, new gym for you, not for me. Young Reed, Santa Monica, and arms. That's it. I'm the MVP. Now I feel like Russell. Yeah, I need it now. Told him on the lay. I've been moving dog. Yeah, I'm on the way. I don't hear the talk. Don't care what they say. I don't got no patience. I can't ever wait. I'm just trying to get it. Sweaty session here because we biked. And now, it's gonna be a super setting workout, people. <laughs> gonna do arms, bicep, tricep, bicep, tricep. Starting with a um, bicep machine curl with a little bit of a V angle in it. And as you've noticed, I always start with a lot of high rep just to get the blood flow going. Oh god, guys, I have such a sore upper body since yesterday. Oof. Second exercise or the superset is tricep overhead extension in this machine. And as you can see, I am trying to keep my elbows tucked as closely together as possible. This was allow this will allow a really nice feeling in your triceps. Five of ten reps. Let's go. Five more. Houston, we got a problem, man. Perfect, let them watch me. Elevating, got them nuts. Cause I'm the pilot in the cockpit. No, stopping in the house. And who? Watch out, get a hit. Watch out. Plus one. Watch out, get a hit. Who? Watch out, set it up. Bet you watch it. Ah, mamma mia. All right. Exercise pair number two standing cable curl, tricep uh, crossover extension. <laughs> that was hard to say. And what I like to think about when I'm doing cable curls or curls in general is to try to really keep my elbow locked in the same place. So not going like this. I am keeping myself posture up and go. Mr. Cameraman had been here before, too heavy for me. So, crossover, grip, grip, cross, move in, lock elbows, and pull. And I'm not overextending my elbow, I'm just strictly pulling, squeezing. So not overextending, just pulling, squeezing. music in here but guys I'm gonna be quick last double not last super set supine tricep push down hammer curl let's go Ooh. as before I am really trying to pull with the tricep and here I'm squeezing a little bit at the end but I'm not overextending the elbow and I'm keeping my elbow locked. And then straight over to hammer curls. Okay, a little bit light again. What's up with me and the weights today? <laughs> Oh. 
I'm pretty even now. And now we're keeping a neutral position to this curl, keeping a hammer curl. Ooh, it hits so nicely. But still very firm, elbows tuck to your sides. Done and dusted, people. What we did was supersetting, supersetting, and only actually six exercises in total which can be perfectly enough if you really push yourself to a good limit, right? Yeah. yeah. So this workout is actually perfect if you have that midday stress or just very short on time because you will get your, your arms blasted. I can promise you that. Um, I, sh I did a big difference between high reps and lower reps which I normally do. I love warming up with higher rep counts and then ease into doing really heavy lifts, but not heavy so that I cannot control it. So that is one thing that I want to leave as a cue for you, that you don't have to do those really, really super heavy lifts to gain muscle mass. What you need to do is actually stay within the mind to muscle connection where you actually feel that you're utilizing the muscle that you want to grow. So that is one of my better, better and bigger tips to grow your arms. Um, try to maybe go to failure every once in a while, but failure doesn't mean that you have to lift the heaviest freaking weight at the gym and hurt yourself. So stay very patient, stay disciplined, and keep doing what you're doing. And if you want to have workouts like this, I would highly recommend you to use the IBFit app. There's plenty of similar um, workouts. I know that um, people think that they need to over exaggerate the volume. It's not about that. It's about the quality of what you're doing at the gym. So I will also actually take you guys with me for lunch. So I will catch you when the lunch is ready. Extreme close up because I did a temporary tripod because I'm too hungry to assemble the, the real tripod. But look at this freaking mountain of chicken and prime, prime rib beef, both from uh, Flex Pro Meals, which you know, because I am getting all of my protein sources from their website. I freaking love it. It's so convenient. All we need to do is like rip it open and um, stir fry it. And I got a big freaking chunk here of something that looks to be so much, but it's literally 60 grams of white rice together with a lot of broccoli and mushroom. So good. I mean, volume is where it's at for me. And- Very low in fat too, after the workout. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So what I try to do after each and every workout is to have mostly carbs and protein. Those two together on a very low amount of fat is what I try to really focus on. Um, and I actually do have this one as well, a uh, fat-free thousand, thousand Island sauce or dressing because sauce is life, just saying. Um, but that is also what I would recommend to you to focus on in your post-workout regimen. You want to have protein and carbs because the carbs will help you utilize the protein that you're consuming. So, which means you will get proper gains and those gains can be lean gains you do not have to be on a very big surplus to gain muscle mass you just really need to work hard and fuel properly so that is going to be it for today maybe this is a very short video but we just wanted you guys to follow along a little bit to see what i'm doing on a normal day um a good workout you get a really good quick workout through that uh, and yeah if you want to have meals like this which is super simple to make delicious and convenient you have that also in the IBFit app so uh, a second reason to actually use the app it's a brilliant app um, and I'm also always keen on hearing what your favorite dishes are so that I can add them to the app so let me know down in the comments below what is your favorite meal and how do you make it let me know. And until next time, make sure to hit that subscribe button and I will catch you in the next one. All the best.